and welcome to Designing with Adobe XD. I'm Marissa from exopixel.com and in this video I'll show you how to design a trendy footer for the destination website that we've been designing in this series. So let's jump right in. First, draw a red borderless rectangle that's 1920 by 240 pixels. Then, grab the type tool and write the following heading, see and do. The font is ASCII BAT, the size is 28, and the color is white. Then in a smaller sans serif font below the heading, write out link 1 and then link 2. Now select both text objects and select repeat grid. Drag the green handle until there are a total of three sets of footer links. We're also going to increase the margin of the grid to 140. Then, change the headings for the rest of the footer links to Eat and Drink, Stay and Plan, and Events. Then, in the right hand corner of the red footer section, we're going to paste this vector liner of the Toronto skyline. I felt this would be a really nice touch for this destination website especially since it reinforces the theme of the website which is the City of Toronto. Last but not least, at the very bottom, draw a white borderless rectangle that's the size of the last section of this website. In Adobe XD, you're able to drag a text file onto the artboard and import the text in that file. I've already wrote a copyright statement in a text file. So I'm just going to drag the text file onto the artboard and voila! Now I'm just going to shrink the height of the text box, align it to the center, and change the text color to red. So there you have it. You just designed a trendy footer for the destination website that we've been designing in this series. Stay tuned for the next video. I'll see you there.